Headwaters has been an independent nonprofit located in downtown Bemidji. Uh, we celebrated 30 years this, this past summer. We are now a, a multidisciplinary program with about 200 music students, both kids and adults. So like push and pull the clay back and forth, okay? And um, yeah, we can do some scoring and slip in too. Yep. Is that pretty easy? Start with a fish. All right. I'm recently retired, and I have been in and out of pottery all during my professional life, but not been able to spend nearly as much time as I would like to. And so I discovered this wonderful community resource where uh, there are adult potters and there are people just like me who are really interested with pottery and want to become skilled at it. And um, I have been able to find um, the community that I was looking for and the resources and the opportunity to grow. Every good boy does fine. B? Yep, that's a B in your third finger. That's a D. There's B. Good job. Last year, two of our board members and one of our employees worked together on what we could do if we applied for a CERTS grant. It zeroed in to could we improve our lighting here in, in this building. It's something that's specific and measurable and doable. So this second floor, we call the Upper East Studio, although some people call it the attic. Um, we've added additional studios in order to uh, make the most of this space. And this was the biggest um, lighting improvement project that this whole area now has lights that are not only motion sensitive, but when the daylight is brighter, the lights dim down. So a pretty impressive energy saving boost here. So it's kind of fun to see, fun to see the utility bill related to this space. We here at Headwaters Music and Arts, we're always tackling projects, you know, what can we do to improve our building, to improve our programming with what we offer here related to music, arts, and community. And we really have a place here in, in the heart of downtown Bemidji, I like to say.